because they're so dynamic and they appear randomly. It's just great. Corgis are natural herders, man. If they don't get the energy out, that's how they act act out. You know what I mean? I wanna break some bones at home. So it's up to you to exercise them or else they're gonna get kinda crazy. This one does that too. She gets a little snappy with my cat. Unless she gets a good amount of exercise. Alright, what do I know about you? I don't know anything about you. Well, you're not invulnerable to arrows. Let us clash. One down. Succeeded. I'm to make you scurry, you maggot. One blast at his horn, and off the hooks in Mordor will come running. Stop squad. These guys are all off. Oh, fuck. You're in my sights. We're done for. Move it. At once. He's a fast motherfucker, this one.
First things first, this guy. Oh shit, did that make them all break in fear? No. It sure didn't. I made some of them break. Fucking shield. I really want to cut this guy's head off. I'm tired of. These guys all come wandering back. Oh, boss! Would I kill Yato? Fuck yeah, I'd kill Yato. She's my nemesis. It says there's intel nearby. I think it's. There's a ton of new captains. There's also a couple of new war chiefs, or at least one that I haven't killed. I should just do this story mission. The orcs that look genuinely scared in that moment? Yeah, fuck them. Overall goal is to weaken Sarn's forces and to find the guy that can remove the curse that's on you, which allows, like, I'm half blended with this, the soul of this old wraith on accident. Do the captains always come back? Not if you chop their head off. When you see me do that hand snap thing, that's like a kill that'll take them out. But if you do a combo and you do a flurry combo at just the right time in their health bar, you can just sever their head and they'll never come back. I had a captain that wouldn't stop coming back, and then I did the flurry combo and fucking severed his head. It was pretty dope. Go do a Sauron quest, I guess. I don't know how many areas there are. 
the black captain, the Gortor has fallen and the black captains have answered your challenge. I love Flexor, I love this game. The mechanics are great. The combat's really fun, just like Arkham Asylum was, which isn't surprising that this was a Warner Brothers game. Uh, the nemesis mechanic means that there's pretty much always new objectives. If you're down to just hunt those orc captains, you can do it to your heart's content. And if they kill you, it's really cool that like any person that kills you, a random archer, a random guy with a sword, if they kill you, they will become a captain. So like I one time just got one accidentally, like I was on the end of my life and got hit by this archer and then he rose up through the ranks and became this big old captain dude. I always use the same model for all the, like, human slaves. I don't know what happens if you piss off all the war chiefs. I think I need to finish this quest and then I'll finally get the ability to brand people and make them my own. So the local war chiefs did nothing to prevent this sacrilege? <laughs> <laughs> that's the war chief that's working they for me. All perished in battle, my lord. All it took me, War Chief Ratbag. Fortunately, you are still alive. <laughs> now, yeah, so I think I need to get through this bring map. Me the head of this grave walker. Claim the head yourself. Oh shit! Ranger from the black. Where was your bravery when we bled your wife and got him your son? Kill him! Ranger, die to die! Okay. This guy's gonna be hard, I can already tell. Okay, can't leap over him. Real pain 